Asia and the Pacific this year will likely be slower than previously thought, the World Bank said on the first day. As many countries in the region grapple with spikes in COVID-19 cases, new variants and vaccine supply constraints. The East Asia and Pacific region, excluding China, is expected to grow 4% this year. World Bank President David Malpass said, down from a 4.4% forecast in March. With countries like conflict tone Myanmar facing a deeper than expected slump, including China, which the global lender said will likely grow by 8.5%, is expected to expand by 7.7% this year and faster than a 7.4% projection made in March, Malpass told a steamed news conference. The speed by which nations could roll out vaccines remained a risk to the outlook with many countries in the region unlikely to be able to fully vaccinate their population until 2024, Malpass said. The immediate priority for developing countries is widespread access to COVID-19 vaccines that match their deployment programs, Malpass said. The World Bank chief said he is concerned about developing nations falling behind in what has become a too speedy recovery with advanced economies, forcing a stronger rebound as more of their people get fully vaccinated.